Hey everybody, we're doing a little quick review on combining like terms and this is for the ASVAB but it's also really really important information for pre-algebra and algebra class. So we're going to take a look at these things. So as you can see we have a bunch of terms here. So again if you have seen the videos on the terminology, each A, 6A or 5A are considered terms. Now this is a binomial because there are two sets of terms and what we're going to do is if they are combinable that means that we can connect them or add them, subtract them together, and because they are the same type of thing. So if we look at this, we have six A's plus five A's, so we can combine that because they're both A's. So we have six A's on the left, we have six, five A's on the right, which means we have a total of 11 A's. So we just add the coefficients, which are the numbers in front of A, together. Look at the next one. We have another binomial. We have two sets of terms. We have an 8b squared minus 2b squared. Because they are both b squares, we are able to combine them. And so we just combine our coefficients, which is 8 minus 2, and we get 6. And since they are 6 of the b squareds, this is going to be 6b squared. And that would be your finalized simplification of combining like terms. Now we take a look at the next one. We have a trinomial or a binomial, I guess, because there are three terms here. Now, there's three A's, there's two B's, and then minus eight A's. So we cannot combine the B's with A's because they're not the same thing. However, I can combine these three A's here to the eight A's that you see over at the end, and those that you can combine. So you can do three minus eight, which we get negative five, so we would have negative five A's. And then because there's nothing else to combine the two B's with, we would leave that, since they're positive, it would be plus two B, and that would be the finalized combining of like terms for this one. Now let's take a look at the next one. You can see that we have an A and an A squared. They are not the same thing. Even though they look very similar, they are not the same thing. This is not like what we have up here. As you can say, these were A and A, we can combine those. Down here, we have a and a squared. So it's not a combinable task. So therefore, I cannot do anything further with this one. Same thing with this one down here. We have three a plus two b. We cannot combine a's and b's because they're not the same thing. They're 100% different. So these two, there's nothing else we can do with as far as combining like terms. And if you want more questions like these, you can find them in my combining like terms playlist. But these are also gonna be located in the ASVAB playlist of my channel, YouTube channel, my Instagram, or my TikTok at you want algebra. Don't forget to like, share, and follow for more.